This plugin allows you to use AI to automatically detect the edges and separate the subject or the person from the background. You need to first of all install it into your After Effects and search for it in the Effects and Presets. We can apply this onto the video. We need to go to the Shape tool. We need to get ourselves a mask shape around the subject. Go to Path and set this to Mask 1. And as you can see, it's done a really good job on selecting the person right here. The edges are nice and sharp. They are accurate. And so far, everything has been included. Now, sometimes you may run into this problem right here, where if the person's hand goes outside of the box, it gets disconnected. So to fix this, all we need to do is open up the mask. And we're just going to animate this mask by clicking on the stopwatch. You want to move the keyframe further in and then go to the first tool. We're just going to expand this box further out and then this will reconnect it from here. We also want to preview this and if your subject is moving within the video, you will need to animate this to make sure it's always staying with the subject. Once you've finished animating, you can scroll further down and set the output to either matte, which will focus purely on the overlay, or you can set this to on transparent. And this will completely remove the background once you have enabled the transparency mode right here. Sometimes the edges may look a little bit too sharp. So if you're not happy with how sharp the edges are, you can turn on the edge enhancement right here. You can set it to small, medium or high. And this will just soften the edges, making it look a lot more natural and a lot better than before. Now, let's say that you wanted to specifically focus only on the T-shirt right here and you wanted to mask this out just by itself. In this case, what you can do is you can press Control or Command and D to get yourself a copy of it. With this new layer, we're going to disable the mask and then we're going to also delete this mask right here. From here, we can enable the other option, which is the point target. It will allow you to target a specific area on this video right here. So if you wanted to focus on the background or on the road, you can focus on the wall, anything else. But in this case, we want to focus on this t-shirt right here. We're also going to hide this layer for now and just focus on this area right here. You can see that everything is staying within this selected area. And then from here, we can get ourselves some cool effects like the hue and saturation, apply it onto this layer, click on colorize, and we can set this to something like 250. We can set this to 40 and then minus 15. And this will give us this nice purple color right here. We can then bring back the original and you can see we now have a different colored top. Sometimes the edges may look rough and in this case we can use the edge enhancement once again to make the edges nice and soft and make it look more natural and you can see it's starting to look a lot better now. You can also animate this if you want to by going to the start of your video. We're going to set the first keyframe to zero and then go further out and then set this to 250. And this will give it this cool looking color change effect from one color to the next.